Hi guys. Alright, anyway, I think you can see me. Anyway, you don't want to see my ugly mug. You want to see the uh, ingredients. Today, I'm going to make a basic sponge mix, I suppose you call it. Uh, it's going to be flour, one egg, sugar, butter, baking powder. That's it. Right, first thing you do is you take your egg, weigh the egg. That egg is 40 grams, right? So you add 40 grams of flour, 40 grams of butter, one teaspoon of baking powder, 40 grams of sugar. Just get any old container you've got, put your egg in, put your basket at the side, be dirty, uh, mix your egg up. This is only going to be small, so you can do this as an individual portion, or you can make a small portion and then uh, Divide it into four. Just for a piece of cake to go with your coffee. And take the butter, put that in, mix that together. Yeah, I know normally you cream the butter and chug it together. Um, just trying something for today. Right. This is not going to work. Okay, this is not going to work. Uh, let me take one of the containers. Tip that in there. Add the sugar as well. Yeah. And mix it all up. Mix it. If you want to make this easier, what you can actually do is leave the butter out and let it melt and that will make it a lot easier yeah. Yeah, see how it's see how it's come together I've only got a silly little two inch screen, so I can't see what you see. Hmm? 
It looks like it's curdled, separated, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it at all. And have your baking powder. Take your lemon kinder Sheet. Yeah. I haven't added the flour yet. What I'm going to do is actually flour the ramekin. But give me a second. I forgot to do something. Just get a bottle of spray oil. Oil, oh, it's alright, I haven't got my glass, bright glasses on so I can't see what I'm doing. Yeah. Yes. Give that, give it a quick thing just to oil it. I've got microfiber cloth. Right hand. And go back to the flower again. As I said, you know, you don't have to be a chef. And don't waste any of the flour. That's just a thing. Just to stop it from sticking to the ramekin dish. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually bake it in the ramekin dish. If you just slowly add the flour, If it looks like it's all lumpy uh, don't worry about it for now because in a minute we're going to whisk it with the bamex and that will get rid of any lumps Cook it on, I don't know, 180 degree for 10, 15 minutes. Uh, I'm going to do this in an air fryer, a rotisserie air fryer. See, as you add the flour, as you add the flour, it will go smooth.
if, if you want a bigger cake, just double the ingredient to weigh two eggs. If you add the flour slowly, it stops it from going everywhere. I could, if I wanted to, actually leave it in this um, stainless steel serving bowl, you know, if I wanted to. See how creamy that is now. Actually, you could actually, I could, I could leave that in the, I could leave that in the Not big enough. <laughs> I'm trying to give myself a headband, but uh, it's not big enough. My head's too big. Okay, forget that one. Yeah, as I was saying, you could leave it in this, uh, and there's no reason why you can't bake it straight in it. So if you make it in like a gla glass mixing bowl, heat proof glass mixing bowl, that can go in the oven, there is no reason why you can't cook it in your pressure cooker, in your steamer, in the oven. You know, you can bake it, you can steam it, but for now, I'm going to Thing. By the way, I'm only I'm only showing you how to cook this. This is not going to be eaten. <laughs> so if I'm not doing things the way you would, uh, don't worry about it because this is only showing you how to cook, not for resale or human consumption. <laughs> Right, if I now put that in there, I can make, I can make probably, I don't know, probably two, maybe three, with this mix. And as I said, this was just one egg, 40 gram. One egg, 40 grams. One egg, 40 gram, and then everything else to go with it. And there you go. There. Is there is your hold on, I can't see. I'm almost blind, so you'll have to bear with me. Yeah. Oh, it's not, it won't focus. There we go. Uh, where are we? Hold on, let me change my glasses because I can't see what you're seeing. That's better. Now I can.
listen to what you say. We're upside down, that's what the problem is. Okay, my screen's upside down. I'm learning. I'm not a professional videoer. I'm not a cameraman. I'm not a TV presenter. Yeah, I'm just someone who's trying to help you people cook on a budget. Like, if you want, think, well, I'm just going to shove this in the thing. Right, I'll be back in 10 minutes. Wish me luck, and I'll talk to you soon. Right, guys. I am back. I'm back. Wow. Wowza. Now we've got the big, the big reveal. Yeah. There you go. Oh, let me zoom in. Oh, I can't see, I've got a face mask up over. Uh, look, as I say, I'm not a cameraman. There we go. I was not expecting that. Right, let me zoom back out. I was not, I was not at all expecting that. It's going to be hot because it's just come out of the oven. Yeah. Now if you go around inside, this is so light because I greased it. See, I live alone and I'm going to do everything on my own. Right? I'm trying to do everything. I'm the kitchen porter, I'm the cameraman. I'm the editor, I'm the producer, you know. 
See how light that is. Yeah. See how light that is. That is really, really light. Let's zoom out. Wow! I'm sorry to say this, but I'm even surprised myself. Oh, looks like I broke the camera. See it bounce back up. That was cut at 180 degrees for about 12 minutes. Right. Subscribe, like, hit the bell icon. And share because this is absolutely awesome right thanks guys you rock love you all see you tomorrow